Hi guys, I'm Nicola McKenzie, founder and mortgage advisor at Dun & McCarthy Mortgages. And today I'm going to be talking to you guys about green mortgages, what they are and why you might want to consider one. So stay tuned to find out more. Now guys, before we get into today's video, I want to let you know that here at Dunham McCarthy Mortgages, we are a team of property, mortgage and insurance specialists. So if you are considering buying a property, taking out a mortgage, a remortgage, whatever your finance needs are, we can help give you specialist advice. And that's from thousands of products across many different banks and building societies. We can compare the options and give you advice on what's right for your circumstances. So head over to our website, which is dm.mortgage and book in for a free of charge appointment today. And if you enjoy the content of this video and you are new here, make sure that you subscribe so that you don't miss any more videos from me. But for now, let's get into it. Now, in recent years, guys, I'm sure it's no secret to anybody that there has been a global shift towards a more environmentally sustainable way of living. A recent 2020 global survey showed that consumers have drastically evolved and that a whopping 60% of us are starting to make more and more environmentally friendly choices. So it's no surprise that mortgage lenders, banks and building societies are also now starting to um, increase incorporate more environmentally friendly ways to lend money. Now mortgage lenders are starting to offer what are called green mortgages. Now currently there are 26 or around 26 lenders that are offering these green mortgages and a green mortgage is basically rewarding you by offering things like cashback incentives and lower interest rates for having a more environmentally friendly property. So let's look at that in a bit more detail. So what exactly is a green mortgage? Now a green mortgage is a mortgage specifically targeted to either new build properties that meet certain environmental standards or ones that have been renovated, again, to improve their performance, to meet certain standards. So usually only homes that have been confirmed with an energy efficiency rate of an A or a B are usually eligible for these deals. Now, when I talk about A and B, I'm referring to the energy performance certificate rating. And I've got a video on energy performance certificates explained for anyone that's unsure about how that works. But ultimately, an A or a B is the most energy efficient properties that you can get. And assuming that your property is graded as an A or a B, then in turn, the bank is going to offer you, as I mentioned earlier, an incentive. And that incentive could come by way of a lower interest rate, an increased loan amount, um, cash back, or a combination of those things. Now let's look at eligibility in a bit more detail. Like I mentioned earlier, it's all about the energy performance certificate or abbreviated to EPC certificate. Now EPCs were introduced in 2007 and they are valid for 10 years. And every home which is being sold or is newly built has to have an EPC inspection, which measures that its energy efficiency on a scale of A to G. Now, how it gets rated is based on things like the window insulation, the loft insulation, whether the boiler's working efficiently. There's loads of different measurements that go into how it's graded. But ultimately, it has to be an A or a B scale with most lenders to qualify for a green mortgage. Now, as an example, the kind of incentives that would come with a green mortgage are cashback options. So at the moment, for example, there's a high street lender that will give you £250 in cashback if you buy a property with a B plus rating or £500 cash back if you buy a property with an A plus rating. Um, free valuations, they quite typically come with green mortgage products. A free valuation could cost you upwards of £250. And then, like I said, a lot of the other banks offering green mortgages will fall into the camp of offering a lower interest rate for an A or B graded property. So there's loads of different deals out there um, and it's just about looking through to pick the right one for you. And that's really where we can help. So of course, get in touch and we can look at the options with you. Now your green mortgages are going to be an option for you whether you're purchasing a property or remortgaging. So next, let's talk about can you upgrade your energy performance certificate rating if you are looking at remortgaging. Now there are lots of things that you can do. So insulation is a key one of them. That could be insulation in the loft, the cavity walls, 
that would be key to making sure that you're preventing heat loss as much as possible. The obvious things like double and triple glazing will also help as well. Now a new boiler can also help to provide a more efficient way to provide heating and hot water and using things like solar panels etc all of these things will improve the um, efficiency of your property so if you're considering doing a remortgage guys yes you can make improvements to your property to make it a lot more energy efficient and you are going to benefit from that because the more um, energy efficient your home is that is going to increase the value of the property that's in turn going to increase the equity in the property and in turn that's going to mean that you're eligible for better mortgage deals potentially and that's better mortgage deals whether they're green mortgages or standard mortgages um, the more equity you have in your home the lower your loan to value the lower interest rate generally that you'll pay but not to mention making your property more energy efficient is obviously going to have an immediate impact on things like your heating bills your water bills and it's going to make those costs much lower so from a general perspective you are going to see a lot of benefits by making your home more energy efficient is it worth the hassle tens of thousands of pounds to make your home more energy efficient purely just to qualify for a green mortgage i'm not so sure about that but ultimately it's about weighing up the overall cost savings to work out again what's right for you but making a house more energy efficient as i mentioned is always going to benefit you now let's look at some other key points for you to consider. Now a green mortgage does often restrict the type of house that a buyer can purchase. So for example, many lenders will say that you can get a green mortgage, but it's only available on say new build properties. And again, you're obviously going to be restricted in terms of the energy performance certificate rating, which usually the banks will insist is a B or above. Now, another really key point for you guys to bear in mind is that just because a lender is more is offering green deals and marketing it in such a way, that does not mean overall that that bank or that product is the best option. It's like any incentive that you get with your mortgage it still needs to be compared to the rest of the market because let's say that you've got a bank offering a green deal at 2%, but there's another bank offering a deal at 1.8%. The only difference is the 1.8% bank haven't called it a green mortgage. You get where I'm going with this. So if you're considering a green mortgage, if you're buying a new build or an energy efficient property, then of course get in touch. We will help you. You can book in for a free of charge appointment and we can advise you if it's the best option. So we can look at green deals, and we can look at non-green deals and work out where you are going to get the best cost savings. And just to summarise, it is highly likely that green mortgages over the next few years are probably going to take over. Consumers, lenders are, you know, putting a lot more focus on climate change, which I think is a really positive thing, you know, and it's going to as well push and incentivise builders and people to make sure that they are building real energy efficient homes. And in turn, that's going to mean less costs on utility bills, meaning that you as the borrower can put more money into repaying your loan, which I think is a is a positive thing at the end of the day. So green mortgages are great, but like I said, it's about comparing it to the rest of the market to make sure that you're getting the best deal. And if you want to look at green mortgage options or general mortgage options, then make sure that you head over to the website, book in for your free of charge appointment today. Like I said, we can look at thousands of products, green and non-green, from lots of different banks and building societies, compare and give you advice and our specialist knowledge on what's best suited for your circumstances. And guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you found that video useful and you're not already subscribed, hit that button below and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any future uploads. And I'll see you in the next video.